my name is Lazarus Calhoun. I'm 50 years old and I've been living at Grace Marketplace for going on three years now. When I first came out here, I had just gotten out of prison and this is where I had the opportunity to come and live. But when I got out here, I was like, oh my God, look at all these tents. From my eyes, that their life is miserable because who wants to live in a tent? Who wants to use a bucket for the bathroom? Who wants to cook their food over a wood burning barrel? Who wants to get up in the middle of the night to take and pour the water off their tent because it's raining outside and the tents is sinking in. Okay, and if, if it's too much weight on it, the tent's gonna tear. Well, what I've experienced in the last, in the past year is the fact that people in my situation have a lesser chance of getting a good job to, you know, to get on their feet and get back into society. A lot of people don't want me living in Dignity Village because of my record, okay? They run back to the property manager and tell him, oh, he ain't supposed to be out here, da 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 this, da 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 that. But the thing is, I've been out here for three years or more, and they're just getting here. I've applied several jobs online. Then comes another hurdle. You got to have a background check, okay? Um, a lot of jobs, they won't hire you if you have um, certain charges on your record. I believe I got about all of them. You know, I got robbery, battery, um, domestic battery, battery with a deadly weapon, um, pretty much everything on the list. But, I mean, I'm not going to let that stop me because I know that somewhere out there, somebody's going to say, hey, look, you know, I'm, I'm going to give you a chance. What's in the past, I should leave it in the past. I mean, I'm not out here robbing nobody, beating up nobody. I'm just trying to live. And that's all I want to do. I want to be able to provide for me and my girlfriend. You know, give us a better place to stay. You know, at least, you know, a roof over our head. You know, with um, running water, electricity, you know, stuff like that. Simple stuff. I had an opportunity, I had the money saved up and everything for housing, okay? The only problem was my record. And the lady came back to me, she said, uh, Lazarus, she said, I'm sorry, but you're not gonna be able to go into housing, not at this address. So we're gonna look around and see if we can't find somewhere else for you to go. And that went on for about three months. So finally emergency came up and I had to use the money and that was done. I mean, I was really hurt because I could have been in housing three months prior to this. But, here's what it is. I mean, we're at the bottom of the ladder right now. And all the rungs are slippery. So, when we get, get a grip on it, we ain't gonna let go. We're gonna climb that ladder.